Welcome to our demonstration system, Industrial Communication with Scalance. This demonstration system gives you a concise overview of the new SIMATIC net components. We will first give you an outline of what modern industrial networks demand of topologies and active components. In the following chapters, we will describe in detail each component of the Scalance product family. Scalance X, the new industrial Ethernet switch family. Scalance W, the industrial wireless LAN components. And Scalance S, the industrial security modules of Sematic Net. The demonstration system will start automatically with Chapter 1. To look specifically at individual scenes, please use the buttons provided on this screen. With the navigation elements shown below, you can navigate in the scenes of the demonstration system at any time. Use the Info button in this navigation bar to call up a glossary of terms, an online help, and a page with links for further information. In automation technology, things have moved away from centralized and towards decentralized applications. Distributed applications are now the trend of the day. In the past, central controllers with point-to-point -point connections to the field devices were replaced by decentralized structures consisting of programmable controllers and field bus systems such as Profibus. As Ethernet made its way from company and production management level down to process control level, and now, thanks to Profinet, as far as field level, today's vertical integration of distributed automation systems became possible. Distributed systems have allowed the network to become an autonomous and essential component of automation technology. This increased use of Ethernet Network number one worldwide offers vast productivity potentials to companies today and tomorrow. A common network infrastructure in production and office not only saves costs thanks to standardized data networks, but also allows consistent access to all hierarchy levels of a production business. Ethernet and IT have an enormous potential for openness and innovation, which is driven forward by a large number of suppliers in the market, all for the benefit of the end user. Compared to office applications, however, automation technology demands some quite new qualities of networks and their components. Because of the often harsh industrial environments in which they are used, Active and passive network components have to measure up to stringent requirements such as compact space-saving layout, rugged industrial design, installation outside control cabinets, universal installation and wiring suitable for industrial use, etc. Production downtimes quickly result in high costs. Therefore, one basic requirement that all network components have to meet is maximum availability and durability. They must allow you to monitor the system and to have components promptly replaced by plant personnel in case of a failure. The data produced in an automation network consists mainly of small data packets, most of which return cyclically. They usually require guaranteed response times and real-time behavior. Industrial networks are to a large extent chosen under cost aspects, because in terms of costing, they are always part of the machine or plant. To ensure investment protection, they must also be compatible with existing field bus systems. There must be a well-coordinated security concept with selective control of access to the entire network or to individual automation cells. Wireless solution concepts must be integrated. The trend for communication and automation systems to merge more and more must be reflected by the integration of both areas into one engineering system. Installation parameterization and diagnostics must be possible without expert knowledge. 
The topology of an industrial communication network is determined on the one hand by the plant or machine structure, and on the other hand by the requirement of easy, flexible expandability. In the following scenes, we will present you the standard topologies used in automation technology. By physical topology, we mean the communication paths of a network, i.e. the structure which interconnects the network components. Most industrial networks are built on basic structures of network topology, or are combinations of such basic topologies. However, they always closely follow the application, i.e. the structure of the plant or machine. A star topology is characterized by a central star type distributor called a switch. The end devices of the network are individually connected to the active network component. This leads to star-shaped network structures. The main application behind this topology is the networking of a great number of automation components with short wires. For instance, in a compact control cabinet, a single machine, or a manufacturing cell. Where electrical cabling via twisted pair is used, the individual endpoints can be up to a hundred meters apart. Where optical fibers are used, even distances of several kilometers can be bridged. For instance, to connect a control cabinet to a higher level cell. For this application, the unmanaged switches, Scalance X005 and Scalance X100, or the managed switches of the Scalance X200 line, are an excellent choice because they can interconnect a great number of local stations at low cost. For a network connection of several autonomous production machines or manufacturing cells working independently of one another in the same area, a higher level star structure is the easiest solution. In this way, star structures are hierarchically organized in a tree structure. A single manufacturing cell with its own star structure is connected to a central switch via any available electrical port, or via an available optical port if larger distances have to be bridged. An excellent choice for the central switch are the new unmanaged switches of the Scalance X100 line with up to 24 ports, or the modular Scalance X4143E, which can be expanded with electrical or optical modules as required. This switch has special features which allow to easily connect it to an existing office network. For wide area networking in a rigidly linked manufacturing line, Industrial Ethernet is also suitable for line structures of the type known from Profibus. In such a structure, one single Ethernet strand runs along the entire manufacturing line, providing cascaded connection via switches and with reduced cabling. The nodal points can connect with single Ethernet stations or with a further star structure. For this line design, which can be purely electrical, purely optical, or a combination of the two, both the managed and the unmanaged scalent switches of the X005, X100, or X200 line are a good choice. If the application requires the networking of drive units, the Scalance X200 IRT switches are able to meet the stringent real-time requirements of motion control applications. Line structures carry the risk that a wire break can lead to a standstill of the entire manufacturing line. But if the line structure is closed to form a ring structure managed by a ring redundancy manager, there is always a fallback transmission path available. Failures remain limited to the component concerned and its end devices, so that the availability of the network is noticeably increased. The ring redundancy manager can be a Scalance X400 switch or a Scalance X200 IRT switch which features an extra fast ring redundancy mechanism with a reconfiguration time of less than 300 milliseconds.
The node components used in the ring are the managed switches of the X200 line. Each connection to the ring requires two ports. All other ports can be used for local stations or for lower level star, tree or line structures. Seamless and redundant integration of automation networks into close meshed office networks is made possible by the Scalance X400 switch. You support both the redundancy mechanisms used in such networks, namely the Spanning Tree Protocol STP and its expansion, the Rapid Spanning Tree Protocol RSTP, and the setup of port-based VLANs. Network segments or single stations that are mobile or difficult to access can be reliably and constantly connected to an automation network using a wireless LAN. Wireless LANs allow you to build up low-cost, no-wear, low-maintenance system structures, especially for use in unmanned transportation systems and monorail overhead conveyors, or more generally, for flexible diagnostics and maintenance. The Scalance W Industrial Wireless LAN products, such as access points and Ethernet client modules, provide a reliable, rugged and secure radio communication solution which fully measure up to the requirements of a harsh industrial environment. Along with the great advantages which a consistent Ethernet structure throughout the company offers by its use of IT technology, the well-known risks of this technology affect the production sector too. Manipulations, espionage and intentional or unintentional erroneous access to the automation cells can quickly disturb production and run up high costs. With Scalance S, the security modules for network segments and the Softnet security client software for PCs or PGs, a security concept is now available which is tailored to the high requirements of industrial communication. It allows easily and without specialist IT knowledge to protect sensitive automation cells against unauthorized access by means of a standardized firewall and VPN mechanisms without having to change the topology or the stations of the existing network. The Scalance network components provide you with the tools for building up consistent, open and secure industry networks. In the following scenes, we will describe the members of the Scalance family in detail.